NFL 2024 Week 1 Pick'em League. Yes, we are back. And uh, you can join this ESPN Pick'em League. And if you win, you get a NFL jersey of your choosing of a current NFL player. Feel free to check out the video in the comment section below for details on it. But in this video, I'm going to make my picks for all the Week 1 games. Give a little, you know, information here and there my thoughts i know this is early but i'm just so excited for the nfl season and oh man i can't wait excited to play this uh with you guys all this season long it's a lot of fun even if you don't win it's a good time so i do this each and every week try to get it out on tuesday sometimes it doesn't come up to wednesday but with that let's make some picks all right first game thursday night chiefs Hosting the Ravens. Woo! And already you can see a lot of people are picking the Ravens, but it's pretty close. Woo! Chiefs are at home. You know, the Chiefs lost to the Lions last year on opening week. I I could see the Ravens pulling this off, but I think I'm I'm gonna go Chiefs. I think they start off this year 1-0. We got the Packers and the Eagles in Brazil. Important to note. Um, this is, you know what? That's going to be a good game. It's on the Friday. I, you know what? I'm going Packers here. I think the Packers win in Brazil. I know it's uh, you know considered an Eagles home game, but I just I think Packers fans will travel well. But I also think that uh, just early on in the year. I think the Packers will, will get the win here. Eagles are still a good team, but I think the Packers will take this one. Steelers, Falcons. Ooh, this, is, this is where it gets tired. A lot of unknowns here. Um, Russell Wilson, Kirk Cousins. A lot of people are giving the Falcons some love. Um, I'm going to say Falcons have a little more turnover going on than the Steelers do, but both teams have a lot of change. I'm going to, I'm going to take the Steelers here. I'm going to take the Steelers. And I, I feel like I'm picking a lot of, uh, you know, against the crowd, but I'm okay with that. Uh, the Cardinals and the bills. Not a lot of people are picking the Cardinals here. I do think the Cardinals will be an improved team, but I think, yeah, I think the bills take this one in week one. It's in Buffalo. That's, that's a tough, Tough first week for the Cardinals. I, I think the Bills take that one. The Bears and the Titans. Ooh, lots of unknowns about both these teams. You know, I'll give Caleb Williams and the Bears a week one victory at home. Why not? Why not? The Patriots and the Bengals. Taking the Bengals. Don't need to think too much about that. The Texans and the Colts. It's in Indy. They get Richardson back. Mm, it's a toughie. Texans have had a really, really good offseason. Sorry, Jerry. Yeah, I'm going Texans there. <laughs> I think the Texans beat the Colts week one. The Jags and the Finns. Dolphins and the Jaguars. You know what? It's in Miami. The I can see the Jags winning this game. I, I could, but I'm going to take the Dolphins here uh, early on in the year. Panthers and Saints. Division rivalry. I'm taking... Oh, you know what? It's temp No, I'm taking the Saints. I'm taking the Saints, yeah. Tempting to take the Panthers because I love you know embracing optimism for a new coaching staff. But, yeah, I think Panthers will be improved this year, but I think the Saints... They got this. The Vikings and the Giants. Ooh. You know what? I'm I'm it's in New York. Daniel Jones is back. I'm I'm actually gonna disagree with the crowd here. I'm gonna take the Giants on this one. I think the Giants win that one. The Raiders and the Chargers. Ooh, oh ugh. lots of unknowns here. Um yeah, I guess I'm gonna take the Chargers, Jim Harbaugh. I I I just like the Chargers quarterback situation a lot more. 
We'll see if Gardner Minshew or Aiden O'Connell is starting for the Raiders, but I think I think the Chargers are going to take it. The Broncos and the Seahawks. Not a lot of love for the Broncos right now. They've been called the front runners for the first pick by some. I'm, I'll take the Seahawks over the Broncos. Yep. The Cowboys and the Browns. Ooh, in Cleveland. You know what? I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna take the Browns. Get get the Cowboys starting off zero and one, and uh, have the media have a field day with that. Commanders and Buccaneers. I'm going with yeah. I'll take the Bucks. Even though it'd be fun to see the Commanders do something cool, but yeah, I'll take the Bucks there. Oh, what people? Ten percent of ESPN leagues are picking the Rams. To go into Detroit and beat the Lions, you know who I'm picking. I think Matthew Stafford goes in there, and uh, the Rams get a little bit of revenge from that playoff loss. Rams go into Detroit, and they get the win, pounding the rock up the gut. The Jets and the Niners. I have no faith that the Jets can beat the Niners in San Francisco Week One, but you never know. But I am taking the Niners here. Uh, tiebreaker. Oh yeah, that's on Monday Night Football too. Yeah, no, definitely, uh, <laughs> definitely gonna be the uh, the Niners here. How many score tiebreaker? I'm gonna take a guess of fifty five. Why not? All right, that's gonna do it for me on this first edition. The next episode will come out. Uh, well, next week. Uh, and I'll just point out here if you do want to join the Pick'em League, I encourage you to. Uh, currently, right now. There are 23 people signed up at the time of this recording. So that's all you got to do. You make your picks each week. You don't have to make a video about it, but I do every week. And uh, just, yeah, love to hear your opinions. Let me know if you hate what i got going on. Uh, if you agree with it, disagree with it. But would love to know your thoughts. As always, go Rams. Horns up and peace out. Let's go Rams.